all right let's see how this subscription form works with netlify forms and fauna so let me fill up this form all right i'm going for a weekly digest and i'll do subscribe great i got a message thanks for subscribing so let me straight away go to netlify i see forms over here I see a subscription form is my active forms created a few seconds ago because just now I've created I go inside the subscription form I see a submission so the submission is for the name email and the frequency I just now submitted this is so good and I see also few options like download a CSV mark as spam and things like that let me go over to phone now so here I have a database created. I go to the database and then go to the collection. I see the entry over here with the same email name and the frequency. That's pretty much it, like how this whole connection works. There's one small thing that we need to kind of see whether I have an email configured or not. Okay, I have so I get a email notification as well over here. You can also go inside the functions to see the function that I have created and they should be created every time a submission event occurs. You can also go inside and start seeing the logs and all right what if you are printing any logs as such that you can you can see it. There is one more important thing to consider over here is that once you go inside the project and go inside forms, you see a settings and usage. Down below, this is where you can actually add various notifications. I have configured email, that's why I've got the mail. So hope this demo was useful to you. Please uh, go through the articles and let me know what you think. Thank you.